On this problem, you're asked to calculate the second derivative. So the first thing you need to do is calculate the first derivative. So dy over dx. This is the chain rule. So the derivative of the outside function evaluated at the inside times the derivative of the inside. So we end up with 8x e to the 4x squared. Now I need to find the derivative of this function and I'm going to treat, I have to do the chain rule in combination with the product rule. So finding the second derivative, I'm going to take the, the derivative of the first function, which is 8, hold the second function, plus the derivative of the second one hold the first function, and the derivative of the second one is 8x e to the 4x squared, right? It's the original function. Derivative of the, out, or derivative of the outside function evaluated at the inside times the derivative of the inside. So simplifying this, we have 8e to the 4x squared plus 64x squared e to the 4x squared. Many different ways you can enter this. For what's coming up, it's going to be more likely you're going to pull out an 8e to the 4x squared. And you're going to be left with a 1 plus 8x squared. The reason why this comes in handy later on is eventually you're going to be setting the derivatives equal to 0 and solving for when that becomes true. And this is never 0, so you're going to focus on when this is 0. However, at this point you should be able to input any correct answer as long as it's um, simplified there. Or any correct answer um, if it doesn't require simplification. So hopefully that helped. Um, if you have any questions, let me know.